the beginning of Halloween! A night of horror for wicked creatures like us! Now go, my loyal servants! Frighten, crush, and paralyze! This night belongs to us! <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm Fate Touched, and this is me playing games. And obviously, this isn't about a time-traveling hotel, as Hot Punk has just pointed out. This is, in fact, about a um, Halloween something or other. I have no idea. I just decided to do Halloween because, you know, tomorrow's October 1st as I'm recording this. And uh, I thought it would be an interesting change of pace. This is a series of two games. And it only has two games, just so I'm repeating myself. I have down that I played this before. Matter of fact, I'm gonna, I should have done that before. Now the music is going to turn off for a minute. I, it, apparently, I played this at one point. I said it was a little cheesy, and I gave it a 4.5 out of 5. Uh, I have no memory of this game. <laughs> so it only came out in 2018, so heaven knows when I played it. And I don't own it, so I only play the demo. Guess we'll find out. It looks very spoopy, I guess. Halloween, Halloween, Halloween. Yes, that is a thing. All right, so let's see what awaits us. No. Custom mode. I love games with custom modes. No tutorial. Um, don't need sparkles on active stuff. I don't need the extra item indicator. Or the plus item indicator. Oh wait, no, the extra object, I always get that wrong. This is telling me if there's like, like hidden things to pick up. I don't think I need that. I definitely want hits though. There we go. The art is really good. making me a little dizzy. Oh good, it stopped. You should not have left the house on this cursed night. I want to drink your blood. Ah, ah, ah. Don't worry, it's me, Dad. I just <laughs> couldn't resist giving you a scare on Halloween. Starting off well. I remember it now. <laughs> that was the most dad thing to do ever. But then the it's me, dad, was oh wow, this this should be fun. Okay, so oh dad startled me, but I'm so glad to see him. I've missed you, kiddo. It's been too long. So what do you think? I did my best to decorate the house. Wow, look at that green haze. That wasn't my doing, but it looks great. I guess even nature got into the spirit. <laughs> Let's head inside so we can catch up. Oh, hey, I found your jewelry box. <laughs> no, he's not. The, the, there's just random green haze and that's cool because it's Halloween and it looks neat. <laughs> this was a good choice. This is a good choice, guys. Please don't tell me he's gonna go huh? there. That was strange. I'm gonna go see what's up. What? Why? Why? The house just ate your dad. That's weird. I'd better find a way inside. Dad might be in trouble. You think maybe? He's a bat. Ah, he's scary. Okay. I don't know what to say about that, so I'm just gonna keep going. Oh, look, it's my bag. See, there's my name. <laughs> it's voiced by an AI. Yeah, it kind of seems that way, doesn't it? <clears throat> Alright. 
I'm so glad that I'm going to school at one of the best medical colleges. I'm worried about my dad. After mom's disappearance, we, we were never apart for longer than a couple of days. I hope his photography work will help him as much as the studying helps me. It makes time pass quickly when you're busy. It's good that dad calls me often. It makes missing, it makes missing home less painful. I can't wait to pay, wow, why can't I read tonight? I can't wait to pack my suitcase and visit dad in Riverstown, Virginia. Time's going by so quickly. I can't believe I haven't been home for six months already. Dad called yesterday. He invited me to celebrate Halloween with him in Virginia. I'm going to buy a ticket tomorrow. Dad says he wants to decorate the house for Halloween and I'm going to cook my special pumpkin pie. I think this will be a weekend to remember. Wait, six months she's been at college? When did she start? Halloween's in October. Okay, well, we don't have a combination to our own luggage, which seems like poor planning. From Virginia Photographers Association to Edgar Sanders. Yeah, going in April and then spending the entire summer there? A little weird. Dear Edgar Sanders, congratulations on winning the photo the photo contest in the monsters category. You've won $2,000. That's pretty good. That's a GPS. Okay. Oh, I thought that said flint, but it says hint. <laughs> Uh-huh. What on earth? How am I supposed to position this skeleton? Why are you supposed to position this skeleton? I found a hat. I, I, I am also already lost. Oh, I guess that film roll is not a actual thing. Was that a fedora? That looked like one of those Australian Outback hats. Riverston Daily. Photo exhibition in Riverston. Edgar Sanders held a successful exhibition of his photos in Riverstown. I guess it's Riverstown, Virginia. Hundreds of people came to look at his work. Last year, Mr. Sanders won first prize in the annual photography contest and was recognized as the best photographer in Virginia. I think he takes photos too. What is that? Oh, they're just really gross batteries. Okay, why are we starting up the evil skeleton again? Well, that's much creepier than the first time it moved. My parents will never find the key for my secret jewelry box in this pumpkin. Little fate. 1996! Wait, 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 wait. That pumpkin is alive. That is a real honest to goodness pumpkin. There, it would, it's not still alive. And her dad set it up as a decoration. So there is no way it would still contain that letter. This makes no sense. And there's, can I just throw the hat at it? Nope. Okay. Rivertown Boat Club abandoned. I, I have no idea what's going on. Ooh, spooky. Dad's worried about security. I've got to figure out how to open the door. Well, here's my jewelry box. Let's wind it up. Apparently that ballerina is made of paper. Number seven is fourth from the end, always in the center. Three will stand. Count every other time. Nine is third. The neighbors of six are both very old. Though it seems a bit reversed, number two must be the first. It's actually not math. 
It's one of those which person lives at which house things. Oh, good. They're going to give me a zoom up. I thought I was going to have to go back and forth. Okay. Number two is first. And number three is in the middle. This one seems slightly easier than some of the other ones, but maybe that's just because I have it on easy mode. Oh, they're both very odd, not very old. Gotcha. Count nine every other time. Nine is the third. What? Number seven is fourth from the end. Okay. That I got. Wait, what? Oh, apparently that's six, not seven. And that's seven. And I guess this one's nine? I guess. Well, I have a bunch of weird stuff in my bag, don't I? Ooh, I have a new message. Hi, dear daughter. Sounds like a... S oh. Hey, kiddo. There's no cell signal where I'm going. So by the time you get this message, I'll be halfway home. You know, after your mom disappeared, time just dragged on. It was like walking through bubblegum. I really hope your medical studies help take your mind off things. Walking through bubblegum? That's one I've never heard before. Wait. I mean, this is a good amount of interesting puzzles, but this is also kind of very strange. You know, huh? Not even gonna give me the chance to put them in the wrong way, huh? There we go. I dove into my work and ended up taking a lot of great photographs. But now we both deserve a rest. Why don't you come back to Riverstown for Halloween? Shouldn't I already have gotten this message? It shouldn't be a new message. Yes, he definitely takes photos, which for some reason I don't see any of. There's Richmond. Oh, Riverstown, I'm supposed to be looking for. Uh, oh, the photos must be in here. Hello, my dear cousin. Your father said you would come home or come for Halloween. I can't wait for both of you to visit. I miss you so much. Your cousin, Emily. I even decorate. We'll have the spookiest house on the block. We can even dress up as bats or as monsters, whatever you want. Is there a bat in here? There's a monster. Do I see a bat anywhere? Ah. It's the shadow of a bat. Bring whatever you have to help us dress up. Hair barrettes, makeup, false teeth, the usual. Hair barrettes are the usual? Okay. I should cut it open. Okay. Aren't those gummy teeth? So what do you say, kiddo? Buy a ticket for the next bus, and I'll see you at home. Love you. This is Dad, by the way. <laughs> it's a video message. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not sorry. That is ridiculous. Where's stupid heart so we can move on from this nonsense? I think that's part of the heart. Maybe not. Oh, okay. I gotta wipe that off with something like this, maybe? Oh, this is dad, your dad. Mom is gone. It feels like bubblegum. <laughs> All right. Oh, baby what? Or, well, actually, those look like baby wipes, but they might be makeup remover. Okay. House decoration. That's a spider. Why do I need that? Okay. That is the worst lock ever. That's like a freaking capture for your house. <laughs> oh. 
Oh no! The little gremlin killed my dad. Check his pulse. Oh, this is kind of cool. I don't think that's how blood vessels work, but it's still pretty cool. Check his eye reaction. Oh, because I'm a medical student too, huh? I don't think that's how you check an eye reaction. I thought you shined a light into the eye to see if the pupils dilated. I wasn't paying attention. Was that that? You lose, try again. I have to start all over again. Skip that. Give him CPR. He's breathing and he had a pulse. Why am I giving him CPR? I'm really confused. You don't give CPR oh, to someone who's- I'm fine now, thanks. I don't even know what happened. I came in and something just stunned me. My maid Ruth is probably in the art room. Maybe she saw something. We should find something to use as a weapon before we look around. Here. What is that? I found a disassembled tripod. Okay, you can use that to hit somebody. That's fair. Yeah, it doesn't look like a house wherein it would be big enough to have a full-time maid. Photo album. This album is where I store my photos of monsters. I take the shots with my magic camera and lock the evil creatures away forever. Sure. Are we going to release them now? Now, let, let's just pause for a minute and pretend that any of that made sense. If our father is taking pictures of monsters with a magic camera to lock them away forever, wouldn't he know better than to walk into a glowing house? Yes. I, I erudite. Yes. Dad. Okay. Now what? Hmm. I won't get it open without the combination. Oh, okay. Ooh, look, the TV is glowing. There's so much smoke. Is that smoke? Okay, if your TV's on fire, that's probably bad too. Why didn't Dad repair the sofa? Now I have to lift it up. That's... weird. Meredith kept our memories on this tablet. Unfortunately, I lost access to them. Edgar. And I left a note with it, with a picture of her drawn on it, plugged into the printer forever. A suction cup could remove the broken glass. This is so weird. Okay. Oh look, the balloons are floating away. Can I get that with all the balloons? Yay. Um. An eerie creature in a photo taken at the fact at the. The factory in Texas. The one and only factory in Texas. The author of the photo, Daryl, says that on that day, he worked on a night shift at a small gas processing plant in Kennedy, Texas. It was about 3 a.m. and there were only four employee employees at the factory at the time. At first, I saw something swaying around the corner of my eye. Okay, that's all we- <laughs> That was uncalled for. Stupid video game. Yay, I found things. What's up here? A camera award. And a brand new screen for a tablet. And a jack in the box. The doll on the scare on the stairs was scarier. Sorry, my dude. What is this? Three tokens are missing. Okay. Okay. Um. Yeah, I know you need me to find uh some sort of. Oh, that's a tripod leg. Weapon. 
need to find and reattach the missing pieces. Oh, I bet I'm going to use the tripod to push up the couch. Because that makes sense. There's a hook on a chain. I don't have a thing. I need to make... Oh, wait. Can I use the hat to... Okay, good. It does feel like that's important. Oh, dear. Halloween news. Well, it's Halloween night, Rivertown, and it's shaping up to be a wild one. Residents have been reporting a strange green mist all over town. The source of the mist is still unknown. That's it? That's the whole newscast? Huh, who would believe those stories? There's mist in your front yard, lady! I need something to help me get a better grip. How about that? That would totally work. Hmm. Right. I mean, you can actually see this particular reality as opposed to other things which are technically invisible. That's a weird couch. I need something long to get that, like the skeleton arm. No? Paper and charcoal. Why can't I use that? Oh, I had to move the other stuff out of the way? The chain is too short. Can I hook them together? No. Can I try the skeleton arm now? Ah, there we go. Baseball bat! I need an emblem shaped like that. Alright, we're gonna beat up some whatever that was in the basement. Perfect. I'll go find out who was sneaking around the house. Ah, uh, I can't just stay here and wait. I'm going to follow him. You didn't have to tell us that. Ruth, are you okay? She doesn't look okay. Oh God, it's Ruth. She's unconscious. Something must have shocked her. I'll try to bring her around. You go look for medicine on that shelf. Here. Aren't I the doctor? Shouldn't I be doing? Oh, well, I guess I'm a doctor in training. Quick perform CPR. <laughs> okay. Why does this live in your house normally? Like, I can understand the Halloween decorations. This is not a decoration. This is a full-on piece of furniture. That was a choice. And here is stuff to make photos, but it's like in the middle of the room with nothing around it. All right. And they have a full-on window in their basement. Interesting. Can I use that? I don't think this game knows how lots of things happen, but you are correct. I do not think they understand photo developing. That lamp has legs and arms hanging from it. Huh. I have to replace the missing light bulbs, then I'll have complete view. Weird. To Uncle Edgar and my dear cousin from Emily. Why is there a gear tape to the back of it? Dear Dad, you were right. A good old-fashioned written letter is especially nice. Thanks for sending them to me. Today we had lectures on anatomical pathology. It's so interesting. I couldn't have imagined the human body was so complicated. Your loving daughter, April 13th, 2017. Yeah, so that pumpkin's been around since uh, 1996 if someone does want to do, wants to do the math on that. Hello, Dad. I can't wait to go on my summer holidays. Studying at the medical college is more difficult than I thought. 
Though I really enjoy all the classes, I feel like it's missing something. I wish I could go on a photo photography trip with you. Your daughter, January 9th, 2018. Okay, so then 2018. <laughs> yes, yes it is. I think the dad takes photos too. Also, I really can't figure out how long she's been at school if she's been studying things and she gets to go on summer holidays, but she hasn't been home, but it was only six months ago, which would have been in April. Dear dad, I haven't seen you for over a year already. I don't uh, think, uh, I'm just gonna keep going. I hope I'll see you soon and I'll and you'll show me your new photographs. Your daughter, September 1st, 2018. He keeps my letters. What else would he do? Oh gosh. That's pointy. Part of this old camera is missing. The lady's still on the floor. I probably could help. I'm a doctor in training. What is this nonsense? Invigorating serum? I don't think this is medically appropriate. Ow. <laughs> the alchemy part of Dr. It's not even like this is old. Like I could see like if she was going to medical school in like ye olden days. This is not ye olden days. It's 2018. You're just gonna give that to the lady on the floor without knowing what happened to her, huh? Okay. She didn't turn into a monster. Oh, thank you. Yeah, you're not going to believe this, but it was a, a harlequin doll I found near the house who attacked me. I saw that doll. But it looked normal. I don't believe it came to life. Let's see if it's still around. Ruth, I think you should go home. Get some rest. Yeah, that's a good idea. Oh, I almost forgot. I came in here to put these back. Here. Why did you take them out? Cabinet doors opened. Maybe it's just the wind. What? What? Did you find anything? Find anything what? Oh, I didn't see them moving. It's a mouse. What's the strange fush under? Oh, we're checking the room. That's what we're doing. Good job. I didn't notice that red cloth at first. Another tripod. Sounds like something's in the suitcase. Why was there a kitty in the suitcase? The plant on the cupboard is moving, but there's no one behind it. Dude, really? Something paranormal is happening here. Is something moving inside the cloth on the ceiling? Why is there cloth on the ceiling? Oh, I guess for decoration. That's, there's definitely something, someone behind the green curtain. Ah! Oh, hello, I'm Harvey. I may look cute on the outside. You don't. But inside, I'm pure evil. Ruth had no idea what she was bringing into the house. <laughs> Your magic camera locked my master inside a photograph, and I'm here to release him. Tonight will be the night of his triumph. I haven't found the right photograph yet, but I see lots of pictures of monsters in your safe. I'll set them free while I'm at it. <laughs> Soon this town will be full of monsters, and there won't be any monster hunters to stop us. 
<laughs> he looks like the newest it, right? Like almost exactly the same face. Okay, we we get it. Why how did he get in our safe? Yeah. Uh, apparently our mother was a werewolf. Who knew? Okay. Did I do that? Or is that, like, something I need to do? Okay. Okay. Oh, and I still need... Yeah, I don't have anything for that yet. Done over here. Well, now there's no way to make photographs if the window is broken. <laughs> Our dad who takes photographs has been kidnapped by a vampire, by the looks of it. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Does that one go over there? Yes, it does. I am not paying attention though. Wow, okay, I got that one without paying attention. A chupacabra! That just looks like a husky. Aren't they supposed to be like really skinny and like with no fur? Or am I thinking of a different cryptid? Yeah, okay, good. That's a yeti. I thought yetis were in the snowy part. Isn't it Bigfoot who lives in the forest and yetis who live in like the Himalayas? This game didn't do any basic research. No, you stay there. Stay there! No, oh, dagnabbit. Ogopogo! I love Ogopogo. Wait, what? Oh, you go there. And you go there. Wendigo! Okay, the Wendigo looks pretty correct. I think he's supposed to be taller than a man. I don't think he wears clothes, but... What is that supposed to be? A metal ring and a shaving brush. Okay. Well, I don't have any of that yet. This just in. An actual monster has attacked Rivertown, creating chaos throughout the city. Authorities are urging residents to stay... What the? Ah! Ooh, a gargoyle. Cool beans. Is this really happening? I can't believe it. It seems to be, yes. I guess so. I didn't realize gargoyles ate people, but shows what I know, huh? Okay, let's fix this tablet that has our pictures from before our mom died on it. Oh, I guess that's not it. That's it? That's all we get out of that? Wait, where is the skeleton? I was supposed to make a skeleton. Was that outside? Whoa! Happy Halloween, my friends! Tonight, the horrible Hatless Horseman will return. Your evil deeds will pave the way. When he arrives, he will need the fear of many people to perform the ritual that will bring on eternal night. So go! Provoke fear! Soon, we will rule and human fear will feed us. And the horsemen will finally make me a real monster. He even has the same color hair as the current it. I can't believe it. So many dangerous monsters are free now. Why is the headless horseman in charge of all of them? Oh, here's a skeleton. I mean, aren't most monsters older than the Headless Horseman? Unless he's supposed to be, like, has other forms. 
I gotta keep it nice. Wait. This arm doesn't look like it can go in the right spot. I guess it's gonna stay there. That would be an interesting uh, Halloween story. The monsters decide to unionize. Okay. Again. Stop. Okay, there we go. So that arm is in the right spot. Your dad packed a lot of weird uh, Halloween decorations. Powder case and a whistle. Sure. We don't have the thing to open that yet. We need an empty vial for- what else? Do we need anything else for the basement? Yeah, we need um, the camera lens and something to open the drawer. But I think that's it for down here. Yeah, just the photos and the camera in the drawer. And then this I need buttons for, and I don't have those yet. So I guess we're gonna go explore these away. Whistle! <laughs> yes! Two gears are missing. Couldn't I just go under it? It looks like I could go on. Actually, to be fair, that fence has holes in it. I could just go through that part of the fence. But whatever. All right, now we have an empty vial, which I guess we are getting. Yeah, I should. Oh. Now I'll add the chemicals. Okay. Once again, I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to add water to the chemicals. I think you're supposed to add the chemicals to the water. And that's not how photo paper works. No, no, no. That That's not how photo paper One day, works. One I came home to find a huge mess. My cat was terrified. The pumpkin heads were scattered around. And there were claw marks on the walls. A monster showed up and tried to attack me. But a shot from my camera locked him away. And you didn't tell me this? I guess that's a very dad thing to do. Well, eh, oh, there's a kitty cat. And I need a camera. Where, there it is. As far as you know, your dad never hunted monsters. I mean, he does go on long trips. <laughs> All right, what is is that the last thing? <laughs> I noticed how many skulls there were on the lake shore, so I started hunting for sirens. They had been luring wanderers with their flute music and killing them. Finally, I saw a fin hiding among the reeds, and I had a new photo for my collection. I don't think this game understands how monsters work at all. Like, I know most of these games are kind of iffy at best, but... Also, I don't think sirens play music. I think they... Sing. Isn't that the whole point? What am I looking for? I'm looking for a fin. Oh, that's a duck. Oh, there's the fin. I like the way this is turning the picture color. Usually when you have to do these kind of puzzles, it just sort of happens. Too many bats in town meant a vampire was hunting. What? I saw it in my house by the light of a candle. 
he was waiting to fill his wine glass with my blood. Luckily, what? I always keep garlic handy in the house. Th that's not how vampires work. <laughs> I can understand not knowing some of the monsters, like Chupacabra and all that, but you gotta know how vampires work. Too many bats. <laughs> bats? There's always lots of bats. <laughs> that's the whole I don't understand. Alright, oh, there's a candle right there. The mechanics of this game are really fun, but... Wow, I... I don't... know what these people... thought, but... whatever they were thinking, they were incorrect. Where's that stupid bat? Why can't I see the bat? I mean, he was reading a kid's book badly. I could- why can't I find the bat? Oh, bat! Where are you? Bat? Thanks, third rate. You're a big help. No, seriously, where's the bat? Oh, there he is. He looked like a turkey. There he is. Okay, that's not a good place to put a camera lens. That looks extremely precarious. Precarious? Something like that. Well, you just broke the camera. Handle for the substitute. No, I didn't think so. <laughs> Alright, so I need something to open that drawer. Did that actually give me anything useful? It didn't, did it? That's one of the things for the puzzle up here. But I don't actually have the rest of it. Oh, I got the two gears. I can do the thing. Yep, yep. me in that photograph. For years I was a prisoner. It was unbearable. And you'll pay for it with your life. Wait. Wasn't it the vampire that kidnapped him? Couldn't he just have killed him instead of putting him in a cage where now he can't reach him? <laughs> Shh. Hot punk. Shush. Didn't we just see garlic? That's- this creature doesn't look evil. Better charge this walkie-talkie. Why? I mean, maybe. Looks like something's tangled in here. I should move it closer. I need something to- Get that off with. There's a mermaid statue. Uncalled for. That was a good pop noise. You can open these with a sharp tool, like a pokey thing? That would work. News. Everyone knows about the monster Nessie from the Scottish lake of Loch Ness, but not everyone knows that there's another lake with a monster in Scotland. Really? It has been prohibited to go to Loch Morar for several centuries, though the monster Morag, which lives there, doesn't mean people any harm. It makes horrible moans and has a horrible appearance. That's not a real There's a boat. Ship's log. Meredith and I finally fulfilled our dreams and bought a small boat. We're so happy I decided to name the boat after my beloved wife. 
Meredith is gone. Every inch of this boat reminds me of her. I can't handle it anymore. Some pow powder, really? I can see it now. It says 1137. Oh, I was wrong. It was 1-4. Oh, were you not here for that part, Erdite? Yeah, the mom is dead. Yep. It was 1-4. 8-7. Oh, I was close. I would have gotten it wrong, though. And everything feels like bubblegum. Correct. And if you missed it, you don't get an explanation until I post the video. There's an access card on this boat. I think he was here for the too many vamp or too many bats part. I don't know if third grade was. Is that a gooey duck? Sharp shell. That's not a shell. That is definitely a creature sticking out of that. Whoa. Thank you. <gasps> You're Edgar's daughter. Don't be surprised. He told me all about you. Oh, I'm a lake monster, but I don't harm people. In fact, I've been known to help them. Here, I found this on the bottom of the lake. Okay. Sure, why not? Sure. What? Okay, okay. Uh, I mean, everything is creepy. Yeah, so he's trying to eat my dad. Um. And... This is a monster hunting kit, apparently. Sure. Why don't I just take the garlic? guys are goofy. Alright, I guess I'm just gonna kill Dracula over here, huh? Oh, this is what I must have meant by... Wait, what just happened? The hell you say? I didn't see where that other one went, did anyone else? Well, that was less than helpful. Okay, I got him once. This is stupid, right? We should just skip this? Somebody agree with me. Yeah. It was in my notes. I'm skipping this. I I I am dyslexic and yes. Well, okay, to be fair, I just killed Dracula and you my bit me. I can feel my body changing. What? I'm going to turn into a vampire. Please, try to find an antidote before it's too late. Here, this will help you find everything you need. Acid? He got bit. Wasn't Dracula trying to kill him? What do I need acid for? We're taking- I don't think it's that kind of acid. Don't get me demonetized. Isn't I, aren't I supposed to do this with something sharp? This is sharp. Fine, be that way. 
All right, I need gas for that. I need a key card for that. Oh, can I use this? So your dad keeps his monster camera and medical supplies in a box changed next to the lake. Is that a syringe filled with silver? There's no memory card. Is the syringe not full of anything? Maybe the syringe isn't full of anything. I suppose that's fair. I like that they gave me a map and so far there's only been like two places to go. Well, let's go back in the house, I guess. What else is in here? I Oh uh, yeah, I still need one more of those. Yeah, I didn't either. I don't know why you'd print out the photographs instead of just, like, hide the thing. Erdite. What's wrong with you? There's a part. Okay, so now I have all the things for the upstairs puzzle. Can I put this in here? Okay, good, because that's not how that works. <laughs> Okay. Oop, oop, oop. Uh, that was wrong. Nice try, though. Quiet time is eight oh, sorry, everyone. It's quiet time. I turned off my phone. Um. There we go. Show shot punk. A secret passageway? I never knew about this. You didn't know about any of this stuff. Look, he decorated for Halloween in his secret room, too. <laughs> her hair is covering her face. That's weird. Every room is Halloween. Let me look to see there. Boo! Oh, look, it's monsters. I guess I need some more monsters. Oh, here we go. Flash drive. There's something you should know, kiddo. I, I'm sorry I didn't tell you this before. <laughs> I was afraid that what happened to your mom would happen to you. To catch an animal, you use a rifle or set traps in the woods, but monsters are nearly impossible to put in a cave. Oh, I'm looking for the words. You use a gun. Put in a cage. Multiple paints were created to catch monsters and make paintings, but it took too much time to paint them. What? Huh. That's different. That's death. There we go. Nope, that's not a watch. That's a, a compass. Fewer people died, but there was still a problem. Until one of our ancestors named Seymour created a magical camera that could capture them in seconds. Seymour? Hang on. The stuff is on the table. It's not in here. I'm streaming. I don't have it. Do I have it? I totally have it. Hang on. Where's dad? Where's dad? Sorry about that. Where's dad? Dad who- no, not dad who takes photos. Dad who lives in the basement. Oddly enough. Wait, what am I looking for? I already forgot. Uh, there's death. Let's see. There's a deer. What am I looking for? A bull. Oh, that's a minotaur. And a moving picture. Camera? Oh. We had a lot of problems with the camera. <laughs> Your mother was such a courageous woman. She locked up hordes of monsters on her own. But it's a dangerous job. 
I didn't want you to follow our path. I, I know, Erdite. I have it, but I don't want to give it to them while unsupervised. If you put other words in these blank spaces, it paints a completely different story. I need a trophy and a dress. Weird way to say dress. And a compass. Oh, look, it's a. It's a little. What was the, they're calling the Harlequin? That looks like him. Oh, look, they're doll barrettes for the doll. <sighs> Lots of drama. No, he's not gonna come up and take a photo. Close my door! What? What? Amber watching? Yes, Amber is watching. Lots hey, Amber. <laughs> Kid 3 says hi. <laughs> oh my gosh. Right. Okay, so. Our mom died of monsters. Good to know. And this goes in here. Wait, who's the other girl? Mom died doing what she loved. That's the mom, who's this? You have a side chick or something? Hermione? No. Dearest daughter, this mirror shows only what you want to see, not the truth. Oh my gosh. You have to accept that I'm gone. Your father has always hidden our family's true nature, especially after what happened to me. I think it's time you learn the truth. Oh my gosh. Your father and I come from families of monster hunters. We take photos of evil creatures I know. with a magical camera to lock them away. We keep the pictures in a huge album inside a safe. Our actions kept everyone safe. One day, one of the photos blew outside and got torn apart. The monster in the picture was free. That's why the pictures must be kept safe. Correct. We shouldn't trust any of them. But I love how you said Hermione, and then we just decided to find the mirror from Harry Potter. Yes, that's... That was unexpected. All right. <laughs> Shush. I love this game. This is my favorite game. Why are there chopsticks and a container of gasoline inside the secret safe inside the globe? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so we... I guess we go inject our dad with garlic essence, which... Of course, won't kill him. We assume. <sighs> really? That's what we're gonna do, huh? The transformation has stopped, but I think it drained my health. I feel so weak. Call an ambulance. Here, you'll need this. What is it? How's that gonna help me call an ambulance? That goes in the camera. Yes, it was a memory card. With a picture of mom. Which I thought was already there. Is this like one of those st 
stupid infomercial ads where the person tries to do the thing and can't because they're an idiot? Has this ever happened to you? <laughs> oh, for heaven's sakes. A pearl! Another pearl! Another pearl! And a candle, and a coin, and a picture of someone. <laughs> I guess. Wait, this one's the mom. Who are these two? Is this me? No, wait, that's the mom. Who's this one? I have not done that third rate. You are correct. I, I don't think anyone has done it. You're not going to tell us- oh, so that is me. You're not going to tell us who these other people are, huh? Why is there a noose here? I don't know! I thought she looked different, but I don't think she did. Or me- I don't know. <laughs> New funnel storage. Are you telling me we don't have a phone in our house or on our person? That that's not how walkie talkies work. There's no time to waste. A lot of people in town need urgent medical help. Okay, so it's go. It's complete havoc. There's monsters attacking all over the place, and it's no prank. Okay. I think it's paranormal. The police are helpless. You really shouldn't leave your home. Okay. Go find your cousin, Emily. She has the magic camera. You need to lock the monsters back up. Emily is an experienced monster hunter. She'll help you. Here, this will help you get to her quicker. Okay, that's actually helpful to get someplace. I will give him that this time. Yeah, I know. It wasn't real hard to kill the stupid monster. You just shot it with an arrow once. And apparently we're a crack shot as, uh, I don't think we've ever had to do this before. Oh good, it's the sentinel puzzle. I hate these. Yep. Nope. Rawr. That way. Quick, run! Who can beat him? Oh, that was very close, actually. <laughs> Go! Nope, that didn't work. Alright, alright, we got it, we got it. Oh, that was close enough? I guess I have to wait for him to move then. Or her. Or it. Or you can just go that way. The circles do lie. Uh, let's try going that way. Why not? Uh oh. This may have been a bad plan. Oh no! Oh no! Go this way. Go that way. Well, we don't want to go that way. We have to let wait and then go down. Uh, maybe not. This turned out poorly. Fudge. Okay, I think we need to let them go that way. And then we go this way. I think. Because you're going to go that way, right? Are you going to go up? Well, that didn't work at all. Okay then. Maybe nope, that's too soon. No, I waited too long. Oh my gosh, brain, let's get going here. Didn't we try this once and it didn't work? Hey, how come they're going that way now? Their path isn't set. You need to move. Thank you. 
Good listening. Oh no! Oh gosh. Alright, that's enough of that. <laughs> yes, we did! You may have trapped me in that picture before, Emily, but now I'm free and you will pay. Do doesn't she have the camera? Couldn't she just take a picture of him? Isn't that how the camera works? No, please. Did he just die? Oh no, Emily. I have to help her before she suffocates. Or burns to death. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. But sure, we can look at this. It's a half-carved pumpkin. How about that? No. I have to put out the fire quickly. Okay. Let's read the newspaper. Appearance of a huge winged creature in Quebec in December 2017. A man from Canada who witnessed this creature's appearance wrote a letter to Lon Strickler, an American explorer of ghosts and monsters. Lon Strickler, however, says that he's been monitoring flying, cryptid, flying cryptids in Quebec, Ontario, and northern parts of New York for a year already and has, all, and has gathered plenty of similar observations. Okay. Don't be a jerk about it. Okay, so we need those. What is this? I can put a lantern here. If I had one. I'm gonna scare the crows away. Couldn't I just yell at them? Uh, you need to find the hose. You need to call the fire department, is what you need to do. I know! Our cousin is dying. I need to pull it closer. Okay. I guess he wants his deck of cards. How do you know that? Look, let's make more fire. <laughs> okay, now we have more fire. I know a place we could have gotten some easier than that, but sure. Wait, that- there's lit candles in there. What is this? What is this? Why did we need a lantern? The cord is too short. I need an extension cord. Okay. I love how we're exploring a haunted house while um, there's a house on fire. Instead of falling the fire department. Okay. We could just yell at it. I bet it wouldn't like that. Look, more newspaper. The mysterious semi-aquatic and hairy Kenmum from Japan. The creature described as a hairy and two-legged monkey. Are all monkeys two-legged? It's called a Kenmum or Kaijinuma in the southern regions. Most often, it was seen on the island of Oshima in the northern part of Ryu Ryukyu Archipelago. I didn't say that right at all. I'm sorry. Water bottle. Our dad takes photos. Our cousin does too, apparently. She even has the, you know, magic photo thing. Do I need to put a coin in? A coin in the cup? Water in the cup? No, okay. I don't know. The coffin is locked. Can I use the chopsticks to open it? No, okay. That would have been dumb. Not that the rest of this isn't dumb. But... For one coin, I give you a glimpse into your future. I don't think I want to know. But sure. <laughs> She's still good. She's still good. The fortune telling machine gave me a fortune cookie. There's deep darkness and you're the only beam of light that can overcome it. That sounds like a fortune cookie fortune. 
Uh, none of that helped me. Oh, look, I think that breathes fire. That's exactly what we need right now. Um, Halloween. I can use this opener. I'd better be careful, though. Well, yeah, it's... What? <sighs> if you're actually leaving and not being silly, uh, see you later, third rate. I, I don't know, Op Punk. I really don't understand. What did I need? No. Why do I need a knife? Oh, to carve the pumpkin. I knew I needed it for something. Well, at least it didn't have me play a game to trace the stupid pumpkin face. Okay. Now I have a glowing magic jack-o'-lantern. Why? I know what this is for, but I don't have a hose. Uh, can I look at that bike? Oh, I can. Tire is completely flat. What? Okay, good. Wh why do I need a bicycle? I, I... Can I throw the bottle at them? No. The jack-o'-lantern? I don't think so. What if I put this over here? Okay, um... Oh, maybe for the bat? Yep, yeah, okay. I don't know how that helped me. Can I hit them with a... Oh, oh. Pitchfork handle. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I found all the tuba things. Is that a tuba? Oh, it scared the crows. Oh, headless horseman, <laughs> my master. Did you know? When you used your instruments to create me, did you know I wouldn't be scary at all? I don't understand what's going on. I thought the problem was just my location. So I started traveling the world to find some place on Earth where people would fear me. Okay. But no matter how hard I try to inspire horror in human hearts, adults don't notice me and children think I'm just a harmless toy. I mean, except you look like it, and I'm pretty sure that's creepy and people would be afraid of you. Soon I will restore you, Master. And when you plunge the world into eternal darkness, I hope you will make me a truly terrifying monster for your unholy circus. Okay, this skeleton pumpkin on the side, something is unfortunate about his head, right? Like... It's usually on fire. That doesn't look appropriate. Why was the fire hose inside the puppet theater? Also, there's no way this kind of clamp is going to hold a fire hose to a fire hydrant. Uh, pretty much. Look at how far away! <laughs> we didn't even get closer to the house! Oh, thanks, cousin. I heard about what's going on in town. Sounds like we've got work to do. But my leg is stuck. Oh, I can't move. I'll try to get free while you go get the camera. 
It's locked in the safe over there. Shouldn't I help? Why is there a creepy hand? I don't want that glove. It seems like there's someone in it already. A living glove. Sure, why not? Uh, it sounds like it to me, yes. Oh no, it's not this puzzle again, is it? Stupid Tower of Babel. Wait, what? I have to try out that strange living glove. What, you think it's going to do something for me? Apparently it did. And now I'm just going to leave it in the piano. <sighs> Filling the bottle will take ages. I guess I need better water pressure. I mean, that's fair. We need a wheel. How about that? There we go. It was a very nice glove. It didn't make a lot of sense, but it was in fact a very nice glove. I'm not convinced her house didn't already look like this. There's some fire spots, but the rest of this is kind of sus. Why do I need to plug in this fire-breathing pumpkin? And he didn't even do anything. Why is one of his hands normal and one of his hands is a monster? Seems unfair. It did look pretty good for a blazing inferno. Is this a matching game or poker? I'm okay with it being poker. Well, if it's poker, it's not right. I know how to do this, honest. I guess it's poker. A weird version of poker, isn't it? That's a flush. Still a flush. What do you want me to make here? No, seriously, what do you want me to make here? A ten four, all hearts. Two and three. There's Jack ten. Well, there's a four though. That's not enough to make a straight. Anybody else? Erudite, are you still there? I have a poker question. No, I don't think Erudite's there. I've played poker before. A flush would work. There are multiple ways to do a flush here. <laughs> Thank you, Ott. Um, move the bottom cards into the correct empty slots on top. Choose the cards that fit the cards already in place. That's not how poker works. <sighs> that would work. If you want me to do something specific, you have to be more specific. Those skeletons do not play a fair game of cards. Okay. Sure, why not? Use that on there either? Oh, I could definitely get in there with a hammer. You are not giving me enough credit. 
Well, I don't know if we're ever going to see him again based on all of this nonsense. She still hasn't got her leg out of there. You sure you don't need help, cuz? Like, you seem to be struggling. A piece. Is it an owl? Look for a key. It's not the owl. I have gypsum. I have an empty water bottle. Wait, shut up. No, stop. Oh no, it didn't! Time's up! Oh no, what will we do? I guess we've been playing for an hour and a half. Time is in fact up. That time it did not crash. That time it legitimately closed. And I guess that means we're done for the moment. So I think we're going to buy this one. And I think we are going to buy the next one. Because I, I, <laughs> this game is ridiculous. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I don't know if we'll do the next one next. We do have to start the next Haunted Hotel. Because that also is Halloween y. Halloween y? Halloween ish? Spooky? Whatever. Well, he's in the hospital. I don't even know if we're going to see him again in this. He probably comes back at the end and tells us we did a good job or something like that. But yeah, so uh, that was. <laughs> that was silly business, is what that was. And uh, yeah. Oh, and if anyone was curious, I don't know if this information comes up anywhere on Twitch. When I went to put in the game name, usually that isn't a problem. The only game that came up that was close was the second game, which is called Evil Behind a Mask. I, for some reason, they don't have the Monsters Among Us game listed. So yeah, we'll, uh, we'll see how all that goes in the next chapter. I have no idea how long this game is either we might have to do two more episodes but we might be able to get it done in one more but yeah she is Ot punk and i am fate touched and i will see you later bye <laughs>